Hey guys, we're going to go over a simple entry to clinch off of uh, it's defensive, right? So off of covering. Somebody's throwing a couple hooks at you, you're cover blocking, then you're going to jam, which means you're going to crash into them, you're going to close distance and get in that clinch range. As you step in off of their hooks, you're going to clinch, knee, turn out. You can throw this in front of them, but we're just going to turn out to the side just a little bit. It doesn't even have to be a 90 degree angle. And we're just going to close the door with two elbows, two horizontal elbows, okay? So the idea here is we'll just do the clinch part first, right? She covers, she covers, she closes distance, and, it, and good. That was like, and she got a real good clinch there with her forearm. Like, I'm, I feel it. She's controlled my posture. I'm buried in here. Now, look, she's going to do one knee. She turns out and throws two horizontal elbows quick, right? Those snappy horizontal elbows are fast, right? On your, on your downward elbow, it can take, it, it's coming from a little further away. Pop, pop. Just getting a habit, we've been doing this uh, in our classes a lot, to just throw two quick horizontal elbows, kind of close the combo up, close the door when you get an angle. Okay, so she goes, cover, cover, clinch, knee, elbow, elbow. Nice, very good, okay? So, cool ideas there, but clinch, knees, and elbows go together, right? Turn out and get an angle. Don't just finish in front of them. You can do that when you're drilling it, but that doesn't cross over strategy-wise to when we're fighting. Right, so we want to get angles. We don't want to just throw somebody out after we need them and just stand there and, and all right, it's your turn to hit me. Okay, so some good ideas here. Um, and like, look, when you're covering, jam in, crash into them, get your clinch. Thanks.